being here today for yoga. I hope you like these videos. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Do press the buttons because it does help other people to find these. Let's get on with our yoga practice today. Can we come into our cat pose? Good, so cat posture. Can we just come into this and have our um, hands under our shoulders, knees under our hips, and we're just moving head and tail down on the out breath, head and tail up on the in breath. Just gently following our, our movements after the breath. And we could notice how our spine feels today, whether it feels a little stiff, whether it feels pretty fluid. fluid. We could notice how our breath is, what our concentration's like. Good, and after our last one, can we come back to cat? Good. Sorry, just pulling things up and down here. So can we just get our tail to wag? So this is our pelvis going side to side. So what we're doing is isolating the pelvis from the rib cage. Okay, so the ribs don't move, but the pelvis is moving side to side. So if you've ever done dancing, and this is what a dancer's call isolation. Now, isolation sorry, isolating hips from the uh, trunk. That's right. So going side to side, like a sort of sort of middle-aged dog wagging its tail. You know, not a puppy, because we're going to do the puppy one in a minute. Okay. So as we wag to the uh, pelvis to the left, our shoulders try and meet. Uh, the pelvis. So we're sort of doing a side bend to that side and then we're doing it to the other side. So do you see what I mean? We're doing left shoulder to left hip and right shoulder to right hip. We're doing side bends to each side. Good. We're doing side bends. That's what we're doing really. <laughs> you know, we've done flexion, extension with the spine and now we're doing uh, side bends. Is that right? Good. Keep going. This is really great for our spine. And then we're coming back to cat and we're going to do the puppy wagging its tail. That's the whole body, isn't it? If you've ever seen a puppy, <laughs> the whole body's moving, the spine's moving, the pelvis is moving, the whole dog is moving, isn't it? <laughs> From side to side. Okay, let's come out of the puppy um, uh, waggle then. And we're going to do the London Eye um, cat, okay? So we're doing the flexion, side bend, extension, side bend. We're going round like the London eye. Or if you just can't see that, we're going round like a skipping rope. Okay, over the top, out to the side, under the bottom again. Okay, spines like the skipping rope or the London eye. That's right, so really great movements for the spine. Doing lots of sort of composite moves rather than just the sort of linear ones. Round we go. And can we change direction? So going the other way round. Up and around, good. Up and around, up and around. And after our last one, just resting. Stretch out the left leg, tuck the toes under, push the heel away, stretch into your calf muscles. Give them a really, really good stretch. And then change for the other side, good. So toes under, stretching into calf muscles. Slowly release, sit back over the heels so the little fingers are to the edges of the mat so we've got a nice big space to come through. But just stretching first of all the glute muscles, we've got hip flexion, stretching the ankles and feet, quad muscles. Can we come forwards as we breathe in? Striking cobra, pause. Exhale, exhale, exhale back, good. Can we go again? Breathing into striking cobra, pause. Exhale, exhale, exhale back. Can we do a few more? So just following our breath. Can our breath be sort of joyful, full of pleasantness and 
bliss. Can the body move in the same way? Good, now the next time we come back to child's pose, can we stay there? Can we just fall into child's pose, just resting back here? If we have problems with the position, we could put our hands as fists, one on top of the other, rest our head on our hands. Okay, let's see if we can just rest here for a moment. Thank you so much for joining me today for Yoga with Kaylily. I hope you got a lot of benefit from the practice today. And as we wish the world peace and happiness, don't forget to join me for the next one next time.